Hello and welcome to What's New Saturday on Sunday. I'm Stickosaurus coming at you on this nice day. It's nice out. Um, it's probably, probably about a nice 75. It's not too hot, not too warm. Uh, my whole town smells like oh, campfire. It's awful. I thought my house was on fire, but no. Walk down the block and the whole whole street smells like it's off. Uh, got some stuff. Got 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 some stuffs. Um, stuff got from Monday the whole way to today, pretty much. Uh, we went to a friend's house last night. They just got married, so we went and saw them and uh, her husband. Kind of want to go shot for shot with some Tennessee honey. So we had about half a bottle. And then we left and I came home, went to the bar, listened to some music and see some people. Because uh, I guess there was a wedding in town, so a bunch of people were in and already boozed up and having a good time. So it's nice to see people like that once in a while. So it was a little rough start this morning. Uh... But that's okay. One of the um, contacts I had at the flea market, he uh, finally got back to me. It's actually the guy we went try to see last weekend when we went to Cumberland, but he wouldn't answer his phone. Uh, he finally got back to me on Facebook. He's like, yeah, I got about 20 games on your list. I'll bring them tomorrow. Didn't tell me price, didn't tell me anything. And, you know, no, no, there's some pricey games on there. So I'm like, I don't know. So I took 70 bucks. Figured, hey, I mean, that's something. God, I got I got eight games for sixty bucks. I didn't spend all of it on him. Um, actually, I kept. I still didn't spend that last ten. I kept it because in case I might have found something else. Because he's kind of in the middle of the flea market. I didn't want to blow it all at once, you know, glug. And uh, he's gonna hold the rest of the games for me. Um, he's gonna tell me next time he's in. So hopefully next time it won't be you know mortgage week and I'll be able to buy the rest of them, which I do need. I needed all but one. I think he just looked at my list wrong because he had Vigilante 2 and I needed the first Vigilante. But, Vigilante? Is that it? Or Vigilant? I don't know. Anyway, that doesn't matter. We'll get there. Uh, let's start with the two games I talked about I ordered last week. Um, been putting it off. Finally went through and got it. Uh, but we got Tekken 7. Never really played Tekken competitively. I've played Tekken 3. You know, I played all the Tekkens. Um, never really played online because I think the last one online was uh, Dark Resurrection or Tekken Tag 2. Either one. I know I got Tekken Tag 2, but it needed an online pass. And I never bought it because I bought it used. So I never got to play that online. Been playing this online. Actually, I have some videos coming up on the gaming channel. Of me losing a lot, um, but we're getting there. It's work in progress. Good game. Really enjoy it. If you enjoy Tekken, you'll love this game. It's very accessible, and it has a story mode with Akuma in it. It's, it's pretty good. The cinematics alone are worth it. Um, it's got a pretty badass ending. I actually beat the story mode. Um, highly recommend this. And we, my wife didn't know this was out. She kind of likes getting trophies. Uh, and she had beat me on PS3 because I got both of the uh, remakes on PS3 as well. So she wanted this, and um, I just kind of bought it on a whim. But Kingdom Hearts um, HD 1.5 and 2.5 and remix. Um, I kind of wanted to buy this because I've never played Kingdom Hearts. I mean, I played a little bit of the first one, and I got to the first town where you meet Leon and stuff, and I just didn't know where to go, and it pissed me off, so I stopped playing um, she's currently playing through it again right now. So when she's done with the first one, well, I guess they're all on the same disc. So I guess when she's done with this, I'll finally be able to get to play. Or I could pop a PS3 version and play that. But yeah, that involves switching stuff, I think. You know, I think my PS3 controller just doesn't hold charge anymore. So it's kind of a pain in the ass because I don't have it plugged in. I should put more water in there. Uh, next... We have um, books this week. 
I know I said I forgot books last week, but uh, or did I? I'm not sure. Either way, apparently, after we did the pod yesterday, I didn't realize I didn't get some books. So they all came um, Saturday. I just never opened the uh, box till yesterday afternoon. But we have Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles number 70. I was on this a long, 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 long time ago. Excuse me. And um, I enjoyed it then. And this, this story just isn't good to me. It's it's with these uh, weird mutant animals fighting the turtles or robots or something. I don't know. Really not feeling this. So hopefully when the story arc changes, I'll give it another shot. Uncanny Avengers 24. Pretty cool cover. Uh, Wonder Woman 24. Batman 24. Action Comics 981. All new Wolverine 21. That's a pretty cool cover. These covers have been pretty cool for this series recently. Um, Deadpool 32. Uh, Detective Comics 958. Flash 24. And what I'm really excited for, because I think she finally transforms, is Hulk 7. Looks to be pretty traumatic transformation, so uh, definitely looking forward to this. Probably going to read this today, actually. So that's it for books. Um, I collect Amiibos. I think, we, I, think, I think we've established this already. And uh, I got some Breath of the Wild restocks this week. So naturally, I had to get the remaining ones I still needed. I still need Boblikin. I'm going to have to go to Toys R Us. Maybe I'll go do that today because the wife's working all day. I'm not sure. I don't know. We'll see. Um, so I went. The restocks happened on. I don't know. I want to say Thursday. We'll say Thursday. Because I know the new Zelda Amiibos came out on Friday. I managed to snag one of them off Amazon. So that, that should be here Wednesday. Uh, missed out at Best Buy. And, you know, I'd work. So I'd, I had to go later in the day. I didn't expect to find one after I was reading online that most Best Buys only got six or something for that. I probably had a better luck in Johnstown. People don't really pick things over in Johnstown. Altoona, forget it. There's scalpers all through Altoona. But. So I went, missed out on that, and GameStop just only got enough for pre-order. So I missed out on the Twilight Princess Link and the Majora Mask Link. I really want the Majora Mask Link, definitely. So I'll pick those up. Either way, so I went to, uh, I got a alert on my phone that uh, Walmart got uh, Zelda. And so, you know, I hurried up and ordered it. So I picked her up. And this was probably Monday, I believe. And I never got a shipping confirmation or anything. And usually with Walmart, I've been burned a couple times getting Amiibos with them. So, I went out Thursday, just checking out the game subs while I was on my lunch break, and saw Zelda. So, I picked her up because, you know, again, Walmart didn't give me a shipping confirmation. Just still said order pending, and I didn't want to miss out because I probably kicked myself. Well... When I got back to work and I checked online, it uh, updated my well, my order shipped, so I couldn't cancel it. So I have two. Um, I told Brian I'll sell him one for the cost of shipping, so he can he can have one. Great amiibo though. I should keep them both myself because they're they're fantastic. And then I got home from work and uh, had Brian. The main reason I'm going to sell him Zelda because he did this for me. He called um, GameStops where he was and eBay, what you doing? 
got away. Oh, no. Well, that's fine. He called GameStop's there, and they had a Guardian in stock. So me and the wife went out and uh, picked up this bad boy finally. Really excited about him. God, is he off. I love this. I love this box. It's awesome. I love... I, I just love it. He, apparently, his legs are posable. He's awesome. I just... I, I can't... I love it. I love it. Perfect. Glad I finally got it. Like I said, I just need the Bobbikin for this Breath of the Wild... Wave? I don't know. I don't know if the champions... Oh, God. If the champions are going to be Breath of the Wild, or if they're going to be just... Zelda Amiibos. I'm going to assume they're going to be Breath of the Wild, so there'll be another wave of Breath of the Wild. But glad I finally picked them up. Got to get the Bobbikin. I know he's going to he's gonna taunt me because I was like, ah, get him. I don't really care because I always saw so many of him in stock. And last time that happens, I really got burned. I really got burned. That's what happened with those 30 edition uh, Zelda ones. And I still need that Wind Waker 2 pack in the 8-bit link. And I saw them... Oh God! I saw them everywhere. You know, clearance. Hate, hate myself. So that was that. Um, that was the week. Then the weekend came. Uh, Friday we we watched the Matrix because the internet was down. Didn't really do anything, so we watched the Matrix. Uh, wife hadn't seen in a while. The Matrix. The Matrix holds up. You sit here and tell me the first Matrix movie. We're not talking about the sequels. Isn't good? Come on now. Come on now. It has one of the best action sequences ever at the end. Um, it's, it's, I don't know. It just fits that 1999 time period to T. To a T. Love it. Love it. Love it. Great movie. But, so we didn't do anything Saturday. Uh, last night, like I said, we went to a friend's house and then I went out to the bar. But today, flea market. And stopped at Walmart to get my wife uh, the Oreo cereal. Um, brand informed us that it was back. And uh, she loved it, so we went and picked it up. Because we haven't had it in 10 years. Because uh, it hasn't been out in 10 years. But either way, that doesn't matter. So we'll go over to Flea Market Games here. Now, I paid 60 for all these. There's eight. A quick, uh, quick little math lesson here, but, you know, 60 divided by 8... Simple. I didn't use a calculator for this at all. It's seven fifty a piece. So that's honestly a fair price for all these. Don't think I overpaid for any. Definitely made out on a couple here. But uh, got Tom Clancy's Rainbow Six. NBA Hang Time with a really fucked up label, but whatever. Uh, NFL QB Club 2001. I believe this was the last football game I needed. I didn't realize I needed it because it wasn't alpha alphabetically. It's in a different place on my list with the rest of the NFL games. So glad I got that picked up. Uh, Bust the Move 2 Arcade Edition. Oh, Bassmasters 2000. Great. Uh, Hot Wheels Turbo Racing. Blues Brothers 2000. What a what a weird. I, gu I guess the Blues Brothers. I think there's a 2000 movie. Maybe, is there? I don't know. Maybe that's why this came out. Other than that, I don't know why they made a Blues Brothers IP game in 2000. I don't even think it's that good. Anyway, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. And uh, this one, getting this for seven fifty, pretty pretty good steal. I've been wanting this for a while, but it's a uh, Killer Instinct Gold. Excited about this. Might actually have to pop this in plays today. And then finally, when I went to Walmart to get my wife's cereal, uh, I figured, well. I kind of had a little disagreement, so I, I decided to pick her some stuff up. <laughs> you know, suck up a little bit. But uh, we got the Lego Batman movie. Haven't seen this. Excited. Wanted to go see it in theaters. Missed out. Wanted to go see it at the drive-in. Missed out. So I picked it up on Blu-ray. I'm really excited for this. 
can't go wrong. And in the same vein, I've also picked her up, ATM Heist Battle. Uh, this is a Spider-Man Homecoming Lego set. It's a cute little set. Uh, I like the little little ATM uh, display. I think it's cool. It comes with Masked Robber with a Hulk mask, a Masked Robber with a Captain America mask, and Power Blast Spider-Man. I'm not really a fan of this new Spider-Man's minifig mold, but eh, it's pretty cool. I don't know how he's pulling an ATM with a gun. That must be some sort of crazy ray gun or something. I don't know. Or laser. I don't know. But uh, that's about it for this. Oh, that is this. That is it. The, it's not about it. It is it. Um, what the hell is my hair doing? I'm a mess. I'm greasy and hungover and really hungry. Really hungry. Ah, probably go eat something here. Should have got some frozen mini pizzas at Walmart when I was there. I messed up. I was trying to get home before because I thought she worked at 10. She worked at 11. So I rushed for no reason. Ah, so was life. I can go up DG here. And they got they got really sketchy. Like $1.50 frozen pizzas. You know, I'm more of a Tony's guy. I'm a, I'm a Tony's, you know, self-serve pizza kind of guy. So I'm sure these are awful. So I'm going to go. Maybe I'll go try one. Um, that's what I'm going to do. Cause I don't feel like cooking. It's hot downstairs. I, don't, I could turn the air conditioner on. But it's just me. Whatever. Anyway. Sorry got on that weird little tangent. Um, thanks for watching. Mercy, I see you already saw your requested video. So got that up. So if anyone wants to check out. Yesterday I did um, my DS collection. And 3DS did a little overview of that, so go check that out if you're interested. Um, if anyone else has any other suggestions, wants to see something, wants to, uh, you know, have a look at my collection, I mean, we can we can look at Amiibos, we can look at my wife's unopened Legos. Oh, boy. Um, you've, you've seen most of them, though. Uh, I've, got a, I've got a bunch of unopened Gundams that I haven't put together yet. I can go through my Gundams if you want. I've got, I've got old toys. i got... You know, Ninja Turtles, I got Mummies Alive. Somewhere I got Rock'em Sock'em Robots. Like, not like the, the punching guys, but like there was a PS1 game, Rock'em Sock'em Robots Arena, which I should play because I've only seen like two videos of it on YouTube. And I've seen one video of like a review of a toy, but I got the whole toy line. They're, they're, they're weird. I'm going to have to find them. Um, would like to find my Ghostbuster toys. No idea where they're at. Can't find them. Can't find them. My brother better not took them. I'll be driving. I'll be driving to go find them. Hunt them down. But yeah, if you want to see any of that, uh, let me know. Game systems, whatever. Uh, but anyway, or or comic series. I do. I do have good Silver Age collection too. But anyway, um, thanks for watching. Check out Not So Try Hard's gaming. Should be a new video up today at least. Hopefully. Uh, I'm not sure what yet. Hopefully Tekken, if I can figure out a way to get it. I think I can. Um, so that should be up hopefully today. So ch check out Not So Try Hard's Gaming. Uh, Stickosaurus on Twitter. Um, you can search Stickosaurus on YouTube. I'll come up. You know that. Uh, check out this week's uh, podcast, the Earbones podcast. We're at issue uh, 119. Shrug, if you can't tell. Well, look at these. Look at these. Look at these traps. Yeah. Um, so that's up. Yeah. Earbones Podcast on Twitter at Earbones. Oh, nope. Nope. Said the wrong way. Earbones Podcast on YouTube at Earbones Comics on Twitter, I believe. Uh, check out Brand, a breakdown brand. He's always enjoyable. He's just flying through his views lately. I don't know. Maybe he's got something important to do. I'm not sure. But either way, thank you for watching. I appreciate it. I appreciate the comments. I appreciate the suggestions. It means a lot to me. I don't have a lot going on in my life. So. Uh, have a nice day.